Hey, what's up, guys? This is Primer. I'm back on the new video. In this video, I'm going to talk about the MI2 March update. So, I, as I'm a beta tester, I already got the update yesterday. So, I already have used it for like uh, more than 24 hours. And we already do know that uh, February update didn't roll out or uh, didn't roll out for the MI2. But some beta tester got the update, but the update was so buggy. Uh, so that's why M M I decided not to roll out in into the general public. So, but now in March we got the March update here. You can see in the, from this screenshot what actually has changed. Hey, there uh, you can see MI2 will be updated to the Android 10. We or we are already in Android 10. So basically, the name here is actually wrong. The second highlighted features include dark theme was already there with Android 10 with in January update. Uh, with uh, gesture navigation was also there, privacy control was also there. So basically, nothing new in this update. So what's actually has changed? In short, there's no change at all. There's zero change totally. Most of the change was under the hood. So let me show you. Uh, I have updated to, uh, to the March update. Here you can see uh, March 1, 2020. So basically, nothing has changed. Uh, something has changed in the under the hood. So what's actually has changed? There's three things I have seen changing in this update. The first thing is overall smoothness. Yeah, uh, with Android 10 update, we get to see a lot of bugginess, lag, and like it was like so depressing to use the phone. But with this update, Xiaomi has fixed the issue. Now we also do see uh, some shattering uh, here and there, one or two frame drop, but the overall responsiveness has improved. The second thing I have seen improvement is the battery life. Yes, the battery life is uh, improved a lot. So right now I get to I get like uh, 20 to 30 minutes more SOT uh, in overuse. So I'm a very heavy user, so that's why I usually got like four, four and a half hour. Right now I get like five hour uh, screen on time. So uh, uh, that's the like a uh, battery. And the final thing has changed is actually privacy control. So what's actually the privacy control? Like from back, uh, Android 10 has already given you some privacy control, but with this update. Uh, am i updated the control has too much right now you will get to see who, which app uh, using what application right now if i go to like facebook uh permission here you can see most of the like allowed not allowed denied here you can see i can allow or deny it like uh, for from here also or uh, if i deny it for like uh, two times will uh, the google will not ask for me that for third time so basically uh, they have updated the privacy control other than that they haven't changed anything so at the final should you update your phone in short yes you definitely should update your phone it will increase the overall responsiveness also increase your battery life if you want your phone to improve battery life or like improve overall smoothness please update your phone and it will help you thank you thanks for watching if you think this information was helpful please subscribe